Kiara guys, this is Armand reporting from Auckland, Ponsonby on the 21st week of my working holiday in New Zealand. So as you guys know, I took two days off from work last week to go to Northland, which is the uppermost part of uh, New Zealand. Um, for, so I tried to pack as many activities into these four days as I could. Uh, the first thing I did is the Cape Bringa day trip and it was really uh, fantastic. The views were absolutely gorgeous. Uh, I took the opportunity to do some landscape photog photography and I would like to thank my friends uh, Jack and Jamie whom I met on the Kiwi Experience bus. Uh, really amazing people. Uh, I had a blast during those four days with them. Uh, yeah, so after that I did the Hole in the Rock cruise which basically involves, uh, well it's a cruise and uh, you go to uh, the Hole in the Rock and also to a bunch of islands and uh, you have the option to go to Russell uh, but I didn't, I couldn't because I had to do the skydive on the same day oh wow, so the skydive it was something I had never experienced anything like that before uh, and uh, I did the 20,000 feet sky, skydive which is the highest you can do uh, in New Zealand I believe the only other place you can jump from that high is in Abel Tasman but I may be wrong um, and yeah it was really fantastic uh, the instructors were uh, very professional uh, so for the first couple of uh, like maybe 20 seconds I felt like I had uh, trouble breathing I don't know if it's solely because of the uh, oxygen level that is half uh, compared to sea level at that altitude or because of the air friction uh, but thankfully you fall quickly so um, yeah, the, once the parachute opened, I could just contemplate the view and the instructor showed uh, like the east coast, west coast and everything. And um, I paid a lot extra for the uh, photo and video pack. And um, you can basically have uh, the option to have just the photo, uh, the video from the GoPro mounted on the instructor's wrist. But the uh, ultimate package, the Platinum, involves asking someone else to jump with you to take your video and photo from like further away, which is what I did. And yeah, you can actually see the whole uh, complete video of my skydive uh, in the link provided in the description. Uh, other than that, the last thing I did was the horse trek on the last day. And this was also a, a fantastic activity. Uh, I think it was terrific value for $120. It was like an hour or so of horse riding and we also went into the water with uh, the horses and I didn't even know that the horses could go into the water that uh, deeply to be honest but yeah it was really fun and I really enjoyed it um, overall it was a terrific uh, trip to uh, Northland I recall someone in the YouTube video uh, that I had seen before coming to New Zealand saying that they thought the Northland was boring I couldn't uh, disagree more I think it's definitely worth uh, uh, going there and uh, Pahia and Cape Ringa are just uh, beautiful places. You should not uh, omit those. Uh, yeah. I think that wraps it up for this week, folks. I will travel to Iran on Monday for two weeks. This is not something that was planned originally, but due to uh, unforeseen events and uh, paperwork and family-related matters, I have to do this. And I will take the opportunity actually to visit some beautiful places in the country, uh, specifically in the capital Tehran and uh, probably also uh, in the north. And so next week, uh, next week's video will be a bit different since it won't be in New Zealand obviously. But I think it's uh, going to be very interesting also. So take care guys. Cheers.